Hi guys, welcome back to METV. So I'm so excited to come back with another planner video. You guys, I'm so happy that I started incorporating these into my channel. I've always wanted to. It's just one of those things that I always wanted to do and I never did. But I'm telling you, 2019 is my year to do things that I've always wanted to do. Anyway, um, if you're not familiar with my last video or with my channel, or if you're new, welcome, by the way. Um, you might not know that I use the Heidi Swap Planner. Um, this is the one that I'm using for this year. Now, in my last video, and I will link it down below so that you can watch that, I gave a tour of this um, planner. I mean, it is just stunning. I love Heidi Swap Planners. They are, to me, absolutely just stunning, gorgeous. I can't stand how gorgeous they are love it so if you want a full tour you can watch that video also in that video I did a mini giveaway and the winner won this little post-it pad which by the way I love I got this at the Target dollar spot um, years ago when I bought it I bought like five or six of them and I've gone through them like crazy like this is what I have left of my very last one that's it but you guys, you know, it's like I've been using the same ones over and over again. I needed a change. So yeah, I decided to share the wealth with one of my viewers here on this channel that's been supporting my videos. And the other uh, prize was this cute little washi set. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. Oh, let me see. Let me see. I'll hold it up right there. It's got the um, thicker washi and then the thinner washi. I love having two sizes of washies. Oh my gosh, love it. So I will flash the name of the winner right here on the screen. The winner's already been alerted. We we uh, announced the winner live on my Facebook page. I'll also have that go across the screen and the link will be down below so that you can like my METV, the channel page. Okay, so um, in my last video, I did a flip through of January and I wanted to just real quick um, show it to you now that it's been filled in um, just so you can see what that looks like once it gets filled in I don't remember adding any additional decoration to this so I'm just gonna go through it quickly I had said I was going to put a picture of my family um, so that it could be my why right at the beginning of the year but my husband's been out of town since I filmed that video uh, he's been he works the Super Bowl every year um, so he's still not scheduled to come home for another week so I just stole this picture from my previous my very first Heidi Swap planner as a matter of fact and then I added this one as well in fact here is a glimpse of my original Heidi Swap Planner. And you guys, look at that. I'm just going to show you the first page. That's it. That's all you get. Is that not gorgeous? Okay, maybe a second page. Hello. Is that not gorgeous? If you want a full tour of this one, comment below and I will be more than happy to share. Like a quick flip through of that one. Alright, so let's move on to um, February. And um, you guys, I don't know if you recall, in the last video I said that I was going to put a binder around this so that I can keep it closed. So I'm going to do that with you today at the end of this video. Alright, but here we go. So this is the February uh, month divider. It says, fill today with love. I swear, her month dividers are what get me every time. Okay, so in this uh, little clear kind of insert that she has I always I either put like post-its like I'll put these sometimes in here um, I'll put um, pictures where's the top I'll put pictures yeah so it's just I, I love these little inserts they come included with the planner but they're really handy because they help you carry stuff around alright so on this dashboard um, of course it's the month of love so I have everything is hearts and pink because how could it not be so I kept this page kind of simple oh, I don't even remember what I did last month see this one was a little bit more 
decorated. But I kept this one simple because, you know, that was just what I was feeling. So here is my month on one page. You guys, I always forget to not fill it in before I start filming. So I stopped myself. I did fill in a few things. Um, but I always forget. I always forget that I want to show you guys. Oops, that's not supposed to be there. Um, I always forget that I want to show you guys the planner like naked before it's been penned in. Okay, so by the way, so, just to share with you where I got some of these things, my washi tape is from Michael's. The um, stickers, this sticker right here, and this one are from the um, Mombi sticker pack, this Mombi sticker books. If you don't know what those are, you guys, please like stop what you're doing, take a trip to Michael's, and go look for those books. They are life. <laughs> anyway, this sticker right here is from hello the Dollar Tree see it doesn't have to be expensive look how gorgeous that uh, sticker is this one is from Michaels this one is from the Target dollar spot as well as this one and these letters right here are from either Joanne Fabrics or Michaels but I think they're from Joanne Fabrics they came in a box of super cute letters like that so here is the first week. Since the week didn't start till this page, I decided to kind of completely fill this page in. I love adding cards like this that I go back at the end of the month and fill in, so kind of like a journal. Um, I don't have a, a book just for journaling. I don't have one just for goals. Like I try to keep everything in one planner. Everybody's different. I know some people like different planners for different things. So. This is about all the journaling I need. I just like to write a little summary of what the month felt like for me so I can go back and read it, okay? Um, again, like I said, I forgot <laughs> to not write in here. I, I finished the spread and then I was like, oh, let me write in my to-dos and I forgot. So the rest of the pages won't have any ink on them. page and again another journaling card and I haven't decided if I'll add a picture um, which I probably will or if I'll journal but I think I'll probably add a picture here since I plan to journal here yeah so that's my February spread and then this is what we can w expect for March work hard stay humble and I added this sticker this was from the sticker packs all these heart stickers were from the Target dollar spot two years ago Alright guys, so I had mentioned to you guys that I wanted to do a um, binding, a binder, I don't know what to call it, an elastic binder so that I can keep my planner closed. See that? That drives me insane. So here's my supplies. Um, this is, this came with another black one. I have no idea where that went. But look at that. It was $1.43 on clearance and I believe I got this at John Fabrics. But you can get stuff like this at any one of those stores you guys and just look for something that's on clearance then I went to the dollar store and I got these I did this once before for a planner actually for this planner that's where the black one went except that now I've lost it um, but um, I love this project because I buy one of these for my planner and then the rest go to me and my little girl and we actually use them as headbands alright so I need to pick a color for this planner um, I originally thought this gold one, that's why I got it, but now I'm looking at this one. Do I want this one? Oh, even the pink one. Right? If that look cute. Let me take this flower out of the packet. Yeah, no. I think I'm going to stick to this gold one. And I am going to simply glue 
the flower to the elastic band and I'm gonna glue it right here where the band um, is kind of glued together because that way I hide that I mean that's a little extra when it comes to being picky but yeah now why not all right so my glue gun is ready I am going to put a little bit of glue right here on the back of the flower. Watch me burn myself on YouTube for all to see and laugh at. Oh my goodness, all right. Let me see how I can do this without burning myself. Where's that edge? Okay, so I'm just gonna kinda hold this down like that and give it a few seconds and then I've got my handy dandy letter opener hello who uses a letter opener anymore these days do you let me know in the comments i love this cute little letter opener i got this at parrot jungle in miami you ever been to parrot jungle i love that place okay i think i'm going to do one more little glob right behind it right on the edges just to cover more surface and then I'm going to give it a second to dry Alright, that dried in about 20 seconds, so I am just going to double check it. I mean, it's on there pretty good, you guys. So, let's try it out. And there you go. Look at that. How cute. Oh my god, you guys. I am not crafty. I've had this project literally for the last three planners. Like I did it for the first one with my niece actually. And then I've had this flower from house to house because I just am that lazy. I'm just not crafty. But the things I do for YouTube, oh my gosh. All right, but I think it came out really cute and I'm glad I did it. Oh my gosh, I love it. So there you go, there is my planner, my February spread. You guys, if you wanna head on over to um, my Facebook group for planners. It's a small group. We don't do much other than post pictures and a little bit of inspiration, but I'd love to have you join me there. It's called Stick to Business. Um, I'll put a link down below so that you can join the group there. And of course, make sure that you like um, our Facebook page. You can post pictures and, co and make comments there anytime. I would love to see pictures of your planner. Um, have you started working on your planner since you started watching these videos? Let me know. Um, I'm going to put a link down below and you can post your pictures in our planner Facebook group. It's a really small group, you guys. I haven't done much with it, but I am in there all the time and I do have a couple of friends in there. And so it's called Stick to Business. I'll put the link down below. You can join me there. You can post pictures on your Instagram account and just tag me. I'll put my Instagram uh, handle across the screen here so that you can follow me there and I'll link it down below as well. Alright you guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!